Hi guys, another video from me. In my last video, I talked about um, how to speed up your internet browsers and how to uh, um, speed up uh, opening up a uh, internet address. Uh, on this video, uh, I'm going to show you how to speed up all of your systems on your computer. It's with a file called um, uh, Oslogix um, Speed Boost. Uh, I'm going to give you the link in the description for it. It's a free download, uh, and you don't have to worry about it. It's all freeware, and it's tested as well, so it's got no viruses or anything. And plus, you can always do a, a, a scan if you want to. Uh, all this will do is it will speed up your system. I'll show you in a minute how to do that. Uh, first, I'm going to show you how to download it. If you go onto your internet browser, uh, I've got my Google set up here, and if you type in as logics. Boost. As I said, I'm going to post this in the description if you don't, if you want to make it quick and easy. Uh, you can always look at the information that they give you. It should be the first. Uh, it, it should have been the first um, link there. Uh, you know, on the uh, Oslogix site, uh, you can download it. If you download from um, CNETdownload.com, uh, which is free anyway, so you haven't got to worry about it. And they're an official downloading site, so there shouldn't be any viruses on that at all. If there is, you can do a scan before you load it up. And once someone goes up, and if you go about halfway down the page, uh, you should see a button say download there. Um, it should say here download here, but don't do that if it pops up on yours because it will just send you to a different site because it's a advertisement, not anything else. So if you click download now, uh, I'm not going to download mine, um, so I'm just going to click cancel. You need to run it because it's an exe file, uh, and you just go through the go through the install um, install settings. And then you can make it go onto your, uh, so you can put an icon onto your desktop. And I'll put mine on my Rocket Dock uh, here. Uh, I know it's a bit blurry, but I need to change it. Um, and if I go onto that, and I'll show you how it works and how it changes your system. This is called Oslogix Boot Speed Boost Speed 4.1. Uh, on the first page it comes to, these should be uh, not started today. It should be not started at all. Uh, now, one button checkup will, if I just show you what it'll do is it'll do a registry cleanup which is in other words every time your computer does something it registers a file that uh, like a sound like a tracking cookie on the internet does uh, and some of the files get damaged um, within using them again now this will it does pretty much a disk cleanup on them it cleans it gets rid of the files that are damaged and the spaces that are left uh, when they are damaged so you can clean them up and delete the spaces so it give you more memory to use up on your hard drive or your RAM uh, the disk cleanup you should have used it before if you haven't uh, it's very similar to that, but that deals with the whole of, not just registry files, it deals with the whole of your uh, C drive or D drive or whatever um, drive you select to uh, clean up. A uh, disk defragmenter will um, defrag your whole hard drive. Um, now, defragging is, is very good in Vista because you need to defrag it like once or twice a week or something like that, as, as many times as possible as you can remember to do it. Um, all this will do is it'll get rid of the fragmented files on it which it fragmented means it means files that are damaged and files that have certain aspects of them missing and it will delete those and the spaces that uh, it, the damaged file were it will delete them it will do exactly the same as the registry cleanup uh, but it will just make your system faster it, uh, and on any of these it will give you a report at the end of it to say what it's done to your system and what it's improved um, it'll give you a percentage of uh, how it sped up your, uh, your your hard drive and stuff like that. Uh, system protection. This will give you uh, it, this this will uh, ensure that your computer is protected from internet um, related attacks. Which, in other words, it means attacks from tr well, not really tracking cookies, but trojans uh, and any small uh, small medium to high threat viruses. It will if you've got an antivirus system, it'll just help that it will just assist that in making sure that you get all of them uh, I've got AVG I've already done a, a video on how to download that and it's a very good one it's completely free um, it's got contracts with Microsoft and all that kind of stuff so you can tell it's legible and stuff like that uh, if I just exit that that's just the one checkup and you can go into this cleaner again as I showed you and this defrag uh, if you can go into computer cleanup it's on tasks on the side here. you've got introduction that I'll open this one here uh, if you go into computer cleanup, you can do an Oslogix disk cleaner, which is the same as a disk cleaner anyway. It's just uh, Oslogix choice of doing it. You've got the registry cleaner, which I've showed you. 
you've got the uninstall manager you can go through this via the start menu and then go to computer computer and then go on to uninstall and change programs features and stuff like that so you can do that and that just opens up another window to go to that startup manager when you're when you log on to your computer and it starts uh, loading things up um, you'll notice that it will slow down because fire uh, um, syst uh, systems of um, booting up that you don't need to use that don't you don't need to use straight off boot um, so what this will do is it will give you an option if I just show you if I just click on that it'll give you an option to see see how I've, I've got AVG I've got Google installer and all you need to do is click on enable disable or you just click off the un uncheck the box and it'll disable that and these will work the next time that you uh, reboot your system uh, they're all the ones on uh, computer cleanup. If you go to automation, it'll do the disk defrag again, uh, the registry defrag again. Uh, th this is different, different to a cleanup. This will re require you to reboot your systems because it is a full defragment. And the other one is just clean up. It just cleans up the basic files that it needs to. A defrag will clean up everything. Uh, I recommend this to do this like I don't know once every two or three months. Not very often. Um, Oslogix internet optimizer now this will look at your internet settings if you just select if you go down halfway down the page uh, select connection type I'm on a wireless network 10 me uh, megabits uh, per second or higher and all you do is it'll do a scan mine just did it because I've got uh, no reason to change it and it'll come up with this, it'll come up with the results and it will say optimize and it will take about 30 seconds to optimize and that's it your system it will speed up your internet as well as the open D DNS server will as well so it means that you're getting even more stuff out of uh, the Oslogix boot speed um, this one will require you to reboot uh, reboot as well uh, this will sort out uh, any memory loss so say if you've got uh, anything that you don't need any system that's not needed uh, uh, temporary files and stuff like that it will just delete that uh, and it will take about 10 minutes um, but make sure you are ready to um, deboot and reboot, uh, well, not reboot, restart your computer after that because debooting all changes systems. Privacy and security will just do, uh, you can track all your cookie, uh, you can delete all your cookies and stuff like that. Uh, uh, that one, you can tweak, uh, you can go into Start Tweak Manager and you can change all the stuff, kind of stuff on that. I'm just going to make it kind of quick so I'm, I want to make sure it fits in with YouTube. Uh, the details, it will show you uh, some details with your computer as it will here. Uh, if I just close that, as I said, you can get a you can get an icon button to go put anywhere you like. Uh, so that's the that's how to how to download a system to speed up your computer. Uh, it's got a 15 day trial on it, but the thing is, it doesn't remember your IP address, so you can download it again and again and again. Uh, and I'm sure you can find some registration codes for it on the internet. So thanks very much for watching. I hope you've been I hope I've been of assistance to you. Please subscribe. Any comments, I'll be pleased to answer. So thank you very much. Cheers.